Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have to share with you my product empties for the month of January. I apologize for the background noise. Um, everyone's home right now because it is the evening time. As now, this is the time that I have to film. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you can hear me along with whatever movie is on in the background. I apologize for the state of my table. This is just what it's become. I've got all my diamond painting stuff there. Um, you know, everything else ends up getting thrown on here as well. But, oh well, let's get into it. What did I use up? Alright, so, I did finish one uh, Bic lighter. I, like, took everything out of this. <laughs> that is completely finished. I'm trying a new angle um, video filming so I have more space in frame. Um, so I'm kind of at an angle. That's So if it looks a little crooked, that's why it's because I'm actually filming on an angle. <clears throat> I've got, I had two Bath and Body Works soaps that I finished, I think. I don't know where the other bottle is unless I did it in January, in December. But anyways. This is the Bath and Body Works Nourishing Hand Soap in um, the Honey Butter one. Honey Lavender Woods, and I love this scent. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I know a lot of people weren't too crazy about it, but I love it. And I do like the formula and um, the Nourishing Hand Soaps. I just don't like that, um, you know, just like every other regular soap that's not the foaming you you just i feel like there's so much soap down there that i just can't get out of the um container i used this uh daily facial cleanser in um i mean from cvs it says compare to cetaphil for normal to oily skin, this worked pretty well. I liked it. It was really gentle, um, but I, my skin felt clean after using it. I'd buy that again. I actually need to buy some face wash. <clears throat> Another facial cleanser I used up is the sample size in Rodile Stem Cell Cleansing Cream. So it's just like a cream that you massage down to your face and um, you mas you rubbed it on your face while your skin was dry and then you rinsed it off with warm water in the shower or whatnot. That's what I did. Um, it was okay. I don't, I just, see there, you can also use it as a mask. I just don't feel like clean after using this. So I don't know if I would actually purchased this. I've never looked it up to see what the full size um, would be. I guess you can check that um, website. Looks like it's a company in UK. Um, it's because I don't really care because I wouldn't buy it. And this is one of my favorite cleansers. This is the Equate Beauty um, oil-free acne scrub this has the little um, the little bee and beads in it instead of the like apricot shell it has like little these tiny little bees it's really gentle and it has the grapefruit scent in it it's really nice I would repurchase this I have a couple times already <clears throat> I finished these makeup uh, cleansing towelettes or just makeup removal wipes i forgot where i bought this but i really really like these i like the tea tree and lavender um if i find these again i would definitely buy more i, I think it was only like a dollar i just gotta remember where i got it um i think ocean state job lot really really good though i like those better than the expensive um whatever that brand is I don't even know I finished oh. oops
I'm sorry about all that noise, guys. This is a silky souffle lotion. I what is this? Bath bomb powder. Silky souffle lotion from Mimi's Tarts and Serendipity. I really, really love these. They're so, so thick and just like very, very rich and heavy. Really good for winter. Um, that dry winter skin. I like this on my feet as well. I um I take a shower. I um put a nice uh coating of whatever silky souffle lotion body butter whatever. Throw my socks on before I get dressed just because my feet get they get really dry in the winter. So that's that. And it was in serendipity. The scent was good. I don't like serendipity in like wax. I think it's like the cherry note or something in there that kind of just like doesn't agree well with me but um in the body care it's it's okay i used up this um sugar scrub in eat me taffy from the bathing garden this was really really good it was the aloe butter one the scent was amazing it was really nice i think there might have been some pink sugar or something in there it's really good or maybe just like salt water taffy um yeah i really like this on my feet and to shave okay i'm not very i don't have a lot to say today um I'm tired i just woke up from a nap that was longer than i expected it to be I finished this NYX matte finish uh, setting spray. I really liked this, and I'm kind of sad it's gone. I'm now working on an e.l.f. one that I don't like at all. But I'm going to finish it because that's what I do. This was a little sample I got from the wax workshop. It's called Cookie Cream. Um, cookie Cream is a scent. It's sweet, moisturizing body milk. I guess the formula itself was okay. It was really good. It says it's paraben-free, vitamin E, orange peel extract, goat milk, goat's milk body lotion. I didn't like the scent. It smelled like sour milk to me. So thank God it was just a tiny little vial that I just used on my hands a couple times while I was at work. <clears throat> a makeup sponge that has seen better days <laughs> this is not finished it's the Ulta Beauty Matte the, the little pot with the gloss came off and it also had the color on there so I don't know what color it is it's very pretty but it stinks it's got this awful smell that it's just gone bad and i put it on and i smelled it on my lips and i was like oh this is gross gotta take it off and there's another thing i found <clears throat> well this is video is a success huh this is the color pop cream gel eyeliner in swerve i love this eyeliner but um it's done it's gone once it got down to like the bottom bottom there was maybe like a centimeter half a centimeter left it just like broke off it was very sad but i would repurchase this this is very good very nice and it's pretty look at that the holographic on the white super cute <clears throat> I used up, because this sucker is dry. I mean, it still gives, ew, what is that? Oh, it smells good. <laughs> Sugar scrub? I have no idea what that is. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> now I'm grossing people out here. This is the NYC Stain Proof Lip Stain. I don't even know if they still sell this. I loved these things. 
it's legit like a marker. And the color was so pretty. And you just put it on your lips to dry. It's not like a matte lipstick where your lips get all dry. It's just like the wetness. Let me see if I can get a little bit. See, it like just colors. Tint your lips. And then you can just wear it like that. Or you can, once it's completely dry, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't go anywhere. See that? And um, you just throw your gloss on there and be good for the day. And last but not least, a hand cream from Bath & Body Works in Vanilla. I really like these creams. I find that they work pretty well on my hands. And their scents are pretty good. I mean, this was just your basic vanilla scent. And I dropped something else. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, um, I hope you like this video. I'll be back soon with my um, candle empties and wax that I used up in the month of January. All right. Talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.